And so when whose idea was it? Because I remember seeing you on the draft, and I didn't know, I didn't understand at the time while watching it what was going on. Who idea was it for you to to walk across the stage on draft day that day? Uh, Adam, Adam Silver. Really? Mm-hmm. Okay. He just called you. Was like, hey man, we want to still have you at the draft for because I know he invited your whole family out. Yeah, he had reached out to my agent. Um, and told us that he still wanted us to make the trip and, uh, you know, that he wanted to do something for us special. We didn't know exactly what it was going to be, um, but he the one who planned that for us, him and the NBA. Okay. Mm-hmm. Did you want to do it at that point? Because I know I, – I just know how I would feel, right? You know what I mean? Because I don't think I would have – especially when you were 22 at that time. No, nah, I was 2014. What am I? I'm 20, I was 20, 20 years old. Yeah, see, I know I wouldn't have had the maturity to to even want to go through with it, even though I'm not being able to fulfill my dream. You know what I mean? Yeah. So what was your thoughts on it when he was like, yeah, we still want you to come out? Did you even want to go, or what was your feelings about it? Uh, I kind of had to put my personal problems to the side, man, because I remember I had – you know, Ray Forsett, you know, he, he had sat me down, like, that night, that same night. And he was just like, you know, this this got to be bigger than you. You know what I'm saying? Mm. He just kept telling me that, like, it's got to be bigger than you. It's got to be bigger than you. So I was just like, you know what? I can set my personal stuff aside, you know, because, you know, I never know what kind of impact it'll it'll have on, on the people around me, you know? So... He was like, you, you know, this is this is the type of shit that you know that that separates the man from from the boys, you know. Mm. So he he kind of told me like, you need to do this. So I did it. You know, I, I put a smile on my face. I had a smile on my face all week. You know, when I was up there at, at the draft, you know, I didn't take no time to mourn. I didn't take no time to you know really lose all that emotion out of my body. You know what I'm saying? And, yeah. Uh, you know, I did what I had to do, and um, I ended up. This, this is where I go because it ended up being beneficial for somebody else who I never even met in my life. You know, a kid named Owen Gray, his dad was watching the draft that night when I walked across the stage. And when I came down, they had interviewed me on ESPN. And they were asking me, like, who, what is Marfan Syndrome? Um, I remember, like, the Marfan organization, they had briefed me before this. Like, they were like, they're going to ask you this question and you need to – have these answers, you know, so people can have the right information if they don't, if they've never heard about it. Mm-hmm. So um, basically, they interviewed me. I told people like what Marfan syndrome looks like on the outside, you know, like what what to look for for somebody if if they have Marfan syndrome, like elongated limbs, you know what I'm saying, problems with their eyes, uh, indented chest, things like that, skinny frame, tall, and uh, the kid Owen Gray, his dad ended up watching the draft that night took his son to the doctor the next day, found out that he had Marfan syndrome, saved his life because he had to have open heart surgery. Wow. Yeah. Wow. Shout out to Owen Gray. He Owen Gray, is he still living now because of that? Yeah, he is. He's actually uh, working. I think he's trying to be a, a ESPN analyst. Really? Mm-hmm. That's dope, man. That's dope. See, I don't, I don't think I would have had the maturity at 20 – to see past my emotions, you know what I mean? But shout out to to Ray for even being able to guide you through that. That's why mentors are so big because, you know, they're able to to see past what we're able to see as the person that's going through it, you know what I mean? So that's big, man. That's super big. Yeah.